James Brand Ellis Knife, a really close competitor with the Victorinox, mm -hmm. uh, but much better design, uh, a much cooler knife itself. Tell me all about this thing. So, I mean, right away you brought up the Victorinox Swiss Army Knife comparison. Yep. This one, higher grade materials, just sort of like a lot more robust, so it's just more useful. What, what implements on here? Walk me through this knife. Inside, right away, there's the knife, partially serrated. Um, it's made with a really nice steel that's corrosion resistant, um, takes impact really well. They actually use that same steel to make uh, like high-end ice skates. Ice skates, really? Yeah. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is called like Sandovic steel. Like yeah, see exactly. Like chef's knives, we've talked about that. Yep, before. it's okay. a Swedish type of steel, yeah. Got it, all right. So this is sort of like a multi-purpose bottle opener with a little Central. end designed uh, to be a screwdriver. A flat screwdriver? Yep. All right. Um, this is a little scraper tool. You can also use it as a pry bar to pry things. This may be a controversial moment, but the lockback yep. mechanism. So the locking mechanism, they actually had to redo. Users were finding that the blade could accidentally shut on their fingers at times. Uh, not a good thing. Not a good thing at all. And then they redesigned it to be a double lockback. Yep. I, I think that's pretty awesome that they recalled the knife, did a new design, fixed it. There's, there's nothing better to me than that for products. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so for $99, that's the price of this knife. Would you buy it? I would buy it. All right. Yeah. I'm a big fan of the James brand, just like the aesthetic and just the materials they use are better than a lot of other blades you find. Top, out there. top notch. Yeah. All right. Yep. Thanks, Sam. Appreciate Absolutely. it. Absolutely.